Now, your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Gabriela Pagan. Here are your 41 Action News headlines for Saturday, August 1st. Teachers want to see their students in person after months out of the classroom, but at the same time, they are concerned about the spread of COVID-19 and a lack of a plan to keep themselves and students protected. Dozens of teachers met at Mill Creek Park at the plaza today to raise awareness and their voices. They said they want to see a 14-day decline in coronavirus cases before returning to in-person classes. Activists on both sides of the state line coming together to fight racial injustice. Protesters from Missouri and Kansas rallied and marched along State Line Road. Different groups united around common goals. The groups made several demands, including demanding the police chiefs in Kansas City, Missouri and Overland Park, Kansas be fired. Clinical Reference Laboratory in Lenexa is joining the fight to combat COVID-19. The company got approval for a saliva-based COVID-19 test. This is an at-home test that lets people spit into a tube and mail it to the lab. The results are given within 24 to 48 hours via their app. Right now, the Kansas company is working with local companies and colleges to supply those testing kits. In just a few weeks, they are going to expand dramatically. They can do up to 20,000 tests per day and hope to get 50,000 in a few weeks. Your forecast is up next. I'm meteorologist Gerard Bailey. Looks like we're going to see small chance for a shower through the remainder of the night. But as we head into your Sunday, it's going to actually be a decent day. We'll start out in the 60s, but decent amount of sunshine towards your afternoon and highs will reach the mid to upper 70s. It'll feel even cooler as we move into Monday. Your highs on Monday only around 75 degrees with lower humidity looking great. Our chances of rain stay low and our temperatures stay nice through the next week.